Okay, so not having it in the Game Caviar Studios, and I'm really excited for Battlefield 3. Uh, that CQB, that close quarters battle DLC that's coming out next month. They also are rumored to have a uh, Battlefield Elite that's kind of like COD Elite, and I talked about this in some of my videos. Uh, I think it was my last Battlefield video, but I really didn't get into it. I was thinking that it's a good idea to do that because um I, I didn't really agree with call the lead at first but it's it's not that bad of an idea it's just that activision screwed it up when they first started it off and hey, ah, give me a dog tag. tag i was running around grabbing dog dog tags like a fool in this game anyway the whole idea of having battlefield elite is kind of awesome and it's really cool i like it i would probably end up doing you know being a part of it but the thing that needs to happen is it needs to uh, it needs to be uh, cheaper than COD Elite, and it needs to offer more features. In order to beat the best, which is Call of Duty, you literally have to beat the best, and they're not going to start selling their games for cheaper. That's not going to happen. But they what they can do is they can uh, add. They can take that Battlefield 3 Elite service and make it cheaper while packing in more stuff into it, you know? I, and, and you can they can add, like, gold guns. They can add special guns just for people who are part of the Battlefield Elite. They can add, like, I, I don't know what they can add. I'm pretty sure if it's going to happen, and it's probably going to happen, they're going to have something awesome that goes along with it. Another thing, Activision is probably like, these fools are fighting off of us, and we hate that. We're hating on them. Give, Give me, me a dog tag. tag. Uh, so what they could do is, I don't think this could ever work in Call of Duty, but if Call of Duty had some sort of rent -a server option like Battlefield did, I think that would be a lot. Uh, I think it would be more popular than it is on Battlefield. It's very popular on Battlefield, and I like using it. This is one of the rent -a server options. I'm going to start up my own as soon as I get some money, and um, probably later on this week, I'll let you guys know. But anyway, see, I tried to get this tag. I mean, this dog tag right here, and I got exposed, and then the dude pulled out his knife. Like, this game is so confusing because you have your, your main gun. You have a backup gun. You can have another gun, and then there's somehow some trickery or some way that you can pull out your knife and just run around with that. It's so confusing to play this game sometimes. I just want to have fun. I need to play this game more so I can be more acclimated to these weird ass controls. Give oh, me did I find a victim? Tag. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Anyway, oh, is that another victim? Is he another one? Oh, yeah, I remember this. Yeah, the dude was running so fast, so I just shot him. I was like, I'm not going to chase you. This was after I had gotten killed for chasing people for dog tags. When you put stuff like that in the game, when you're like, you can knife somebody in the back, you take that dog tag. It's like, that's what I like to do. So I'm going to do it. And it kind of got me, it, it, it backfired a lot in this, this match. This match was 20 minutes long. I was going to do an adorned 20 minute commentary, but I was like, nah, that's not that great of an idea right now. Back on subject, Call of Duty. And because they don't, I don't know whether you need to have dedicated servers to have the rent a server. Uh, option and then most likely that's the case i didn't really do any research on this i'm just talking out of my ass anyway but if call of duty had something like that that would be pretty cool I mean, actually you know what they do have something like that be honest with you now that i think about it they have the the damn the private matches but do they have problem that well i don't i don't know i don't know they do have like a private match but it's not really as you can't really change that many things inside of the private match in call of duty like you can in uh battlefield so in order for them to actually do that what they could do instead of renting a server they can have it to where whoever setting up the private match has a longer list of things that you can change and it could be like you know gravity 50 percent where you can jump tag. all the way up in the air and you know bullets are uh one tenth of the strength but you have uh ten thousand more bullets and you never have to reload kind of the kind of sort of the things that people already do in call of duty when they hack the game 
in um, a way to, I think a, a good way to limit that is to actually incorporate it into the game. Because if people are constantly hacking Call of Duty and it happens a lot, especially the older Call of Duties, and they do the things the way they have like infinite health or some, they, there was some sort of, uh, uh, what was it called? There was a mod or a hack, I should say, that had, uh, it was like zombies, but it was in COD 4. And it's kind of like infected in Modern Warfare 3. I saw a video of it a while ago. It was weird. But if they incorporated that into the game, you take away the hacker's motivation to hack the game because it's already in the game. And uh, another thing is, look at this. They put me in timeout. It's like they spawned me in this corner and I was so pissed off. I was screaming at the top of my lungs right here. Anyway, if you do that, you take away the hacker's motivation to be in the game and, and to hack the game. But that's one of the things that, that can happen. But back on Battlefield Elite, I believe it's gonna happen. Yeah, I think it's gonna be tag. announced at E3. And revive, get up. I'm a medic. I, the one thing I hate about being a medic is when you run across the map to save somebody and as soon as you get up to them with your little paddles out, they die. You're like, wow, why would you? What I thought while I was doing this, this happened a lot. I was like, in kill zone, if, you, if there was a medic on your team and you lay there and you're about to die, there was a beacon that showed up that showed you how far away the medic was. Give me and a dog it did, tag. Ah, give me your dog tag. And you had the option of standing, laying there and waiting for the medic, or you can bleed out and die. I think they need to do that in this game. That way people will just, you know, know. And I'm not, I don't, it's, it's structured different in this game because while you're, you could be, choosing where to spawn at or, or doing some sort of changing your class and then you get revived so it's sim it's kind of different but they can, i don't know these guys are geniuses look at the game they made they can figure it out i don't know i don't get paid to do that i make youtube videos so i think that uh cod elite is going to be um uh, announced at e3 and i believe that, not cod elite i'm sorry battlefield elite it's going to be uh Announced at E3. Somebody said on one of my other videos. Give me the dog tag. Oh, I was on a roll this match. Uh, somebody said that it was called Battle Log. I think that's kind of a gay name. I don't like it. Uh, um, it's kind of weird. But anyway, uh, I think that it's going to be announced, and I would like it to be cheaper and have more. You know, more for less. That way, you you. You can say that, look, we're doing more than what Cod Elite is doing. We have a better product, and we have yeah, arguably, yeah. I say arguably, the better game. Now, this right here, this dude should have gave me his dog tag, but I give him props because he was like, I'm not going to give it up. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to lay right here and kill you by shooting your ankles to death. Anyway, this video is almost over. Uh, some of the things that they can put in Battlefield Elite slash Battle Log, whatever it's going to be called, I don't know. Give me your thoughts. What do you think? Uh, subscriber Saturdays are coming. Uh, my, my last video was talking about that. Modern Warfare 3 Gold Guns. And uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? Like, comment, subscribe. Of course, as always. And uh, what else? What else? What else? That's about it.